In this video, I'm showing you exactly how to fix a certain property having a too high or low error um, with your Minecraft Bedrock Edition texture packs. So I've just got an example pack right over here. And as you can see, when I double click on this and it automatically imports, import started and then there's been an error. We can press on this and it's going to give us the entire output log here. We can find the error. And as you can see, a certain property, which is header slash min engine version, uh, has a version which is too high. And that is going to be the error that we are going to be solving today. Of course, there are a bunch of variations of that specific error. Um, this was just an example, of course. Anyways, to fix this, you want to head over to my Minecraft Bedrock Edition texture pack fixer for your convenience. This will be linked down right in the description below and what this is going to do is make it really really easy for us to fix these errors without having to completely extract the pack and the like because that's all a little complicated so once you're over here we can simply choose our pack i know that mine is located on my desktop so if i scroll around over here then i should be able to find it there we are that's my pack then our game version is obviously going to be Bedrock Edition for now, and then we want to choose the issue we're experiencing. In this case, a certain property had a version which was too high or low. Um, if you were experiencing a different issue, then you can select that from over here, or even just choose other if it was none of the above. Anyways, once we have selected that, we can simply press on this fix button right over here and that is going to briefly bring you to an ad page where you can wait while your pack processes this just covers the hosting costs for the website and after around five seconds you can press on the skip button and then just like that your download is going to start automatically for the rest on this page you can find some additional resources should you need them but now as you can see in my downloads, we've got the fixed pack right over here. Um, it has actually been renamed randomly and that is just to avoid any uh, errors in the system of my website. But you can just rename this back to anything you want if you want to. Um, but we can click on this for right now and you see import started and then just like that successfully imported. In this case, my texture pack, which is called me 64 is better outlined ors. Um, I was too lazy to add a pack icon, but oh well, <laughs> that's why we're getting to this purple thing. So, right over here, there's the pack, it's going to be located in your global resources, we can activate it if we want to do that, and really, it's just as simple as that. So, if this worked for you, then make sure to uh, subscribe and like, of course, uh, and if it didn't, which of course is always a possibility that it doesn't work for you, then feel free to reach out to me on a Discord or whatever else, and I'll take a look at your pack and maybe even use it to um, improve this computer system for future users. Anyways, for right now, that was basically that. Thank you ever so much for watching, and I do of course hope to see you again in the next one. Bye-bye!